I'm glad that the interfaith movement has got beyond just trying to get a Hindu and a Muslim you know, to sit down and about each other and we don't necessarily want to spend our time talking about the next life and actually focus on the urgent issues which concern us all because we share this one planet together. In 1943, Bishop George Bell, who was Bishop of Chichester, when there was a debate about the setting up of the United Nations, said at that time that there must also be a spiritual council to accompany the work of the United Nations. And he recognised then that it must represent all religions. Which, and in fact, because the First Assembly took place in London, the World Congress um, arranged a meeting to try to push that forward. But then you've got the long block of, sort of communist opposition. And indeed, really up until the last sort of 10 years, most politicians ignored religion. The real reason we need to come together and why we want this Council of the United Nations is that there is an important spiritual and moral dimension to all the major problems that face our society. I've been very concerned we don't just have religious leaders talking about you know, peace, which I guess most of them are in favour of, but um, we actually engage with people who have to make the practical decisions.